So many of us are concerned about the future of business or rather the future of jobs because of the automation and with um, machines and AI and machine learning coming in the picture and automating most of the jobs that are repetitive. So how important is invisible selling then? I did a talk on how we need to adapt to a technologically rich future, a future where plenty of jobs will be outsourced to machines, robots and algorithms. I, I did this TEDx talk way back in 2013 and I was wondering that time why more people are not talking about the challenges of the future and suggesting ways that people today can meet those challenges. So what should you do to ensure that as more and more jobs and businesses get lost to technology, they don't eat into your territory? So plenty of guys now are talking about it. I'm very, very happy that's happened. And we will probably look at what these big guys are saying in different videos. But in this video, I want to focus on what Yuval Noah Harari is saying. Uh, Yuval Noah Harari is one of the biggest thought leaders in the world today. Uh, very, very senior people, the, the top chief executives of countries and of companies uh, look at what he's saying and are taking it very, very seriously. I, I think Bill Gates, Mark Zuckerberg, Elon Musk, uh, and uh, Obama, all these guys are taking his books very, very seriously. So he has written three books. Uh, the first book, which really skyrocketed him into international fame, was a book called Sapiens, uh, which is the history of mankind, uh, history of human stupidity, uh, of human follies, and the uh, lessons we can learn from there. Uh, the second book was Homo Deus. Uh, which is homo as in homo sapiens, as in human beings, and deus as in god. So he's saying that we now have the powers that uh, apparently gods uh, are thought to of as having because of technology. And the third book, the latest book of his is 21 Lessons for the 21st Century, where he is also talking about the future of work. What should you do to ensure that your job is not gone to a robot or an algorithm or your business is not lost to technology and he's spoken about the four C's that are absolutely critical that every human being should know about uh, one of them or two of them have to do with thinking and two of them have to do with how we relate to other people and I, I'm, I'm, I was very pleased to see that list because uh, plenty of people will probably think that I've paid him to write those four C's because two of those C's are being taken care of by my mapping and two of those C's are being taken care of by invisible selling. Wow. <laughs> okay, so the two C's that are being taken care of by my mapping is critical thinking okay. and creativity. Okay, these skills according to Yuval Harari are very, very critical if you want to be successful in the future. And in terms of influencing people, uh, he's talked about communication and collaboration. So you have to be good at these four things. Critical thinking, creativity, communication, and collaboration. Now, communication and collaboration is something that you cannot be good at unless you understand the science of influence or the science of persuasion, which is exactly what invisible selling is. It's for everyone. Uh, it's not only for people who are into selling. Yes. So, uh, I, I was very happy. I never expected to have 100% hit rate in terms of what he was thinking is important for the future and in terms of what I was thinking is important for the future. And I didn't select these subjects because they're important for the future. I selected these subjects because I was interested in these subjects. So, it's just a coincidence that these are thought of by Yuval Harari as very, very critical skills. So, Maybe I'm lucky, maybe it's something else, but I'm very happy that our thought processes match. Yes. 